dear students welcome to e shikshana program in the last class we discussed eulers method modified eulers method and its geometrical interpretation and we have seen the advantage of modified eulers method over eulers method the eulers method quickly gives the values of y but accumulates errors in large as we compute values of y for the as we proceed computing values of y for the specified values of x okay say in your course third semester mathematics course 18 mat 31 you have only modified eulers method so in modified eulers method first we predict the value of y using eulers method and improve or correct this value using iteration formula that is given by this formula so we predict the value of y using eulers formula and then correct it using the iteration formula so these two put together is our eulers modified method so let me consider uh, examples are modified eulers method So problem one. Determine. Determine the value. Determine the value of y for for x is equal to zero. Zero point. Zero five up to point one. That is zero to point one in steps of zero point zero five. Given that, given, given that dy by dx, dy by dx is equal to x square plus y, where Y is one when x is equal to one. That is the initial condition. Using using modify using modify Euler's method. Modify Euler's method up to four decimal places. Up to four. Places of decimals are four decimal places. Four decimal places. So this is the question. So we need to find the value at x with the step length zero point zero five. The given initial condition is y is one at x is equal to two. Okay. Now let us first write down the data given. The data given in the problem. So the solution part, the solution part. So let us write what is given here. Given, ah, uh, this is f of x comma y. dy by dx is equal to f of x comma y. Now, so f of x comma y is ah uh, given x square plus y. So given, f of x comma y is equal to x square plus y. f of x comma y is x square plus y. And this is the step plan. This is the step plan that is your h. That is your h. H is zero point zero five. H is zero point five. Now, what is x naught? X naught is equal to zero. So this is your x naught. The corresponding value of y, y naught is one. Y naught is one. The next value of x is add h to x naught. That is zero plus point zero five. This is your x bar, zero point zero five, and corresponding value you have obtained using modified Euler's method. Then, uh, till you get point bar, keep adding zero point zero five to the previous value of x. So x two is zero point zero five plus zero point zero five is zero point zero point one, and corresponding value of y two. We need to calculate again using modified Euler's method. Okay. 
So now, so having given this, uh, let us write down the formula, iterative formula. Modified, modified, Euler's, modified Euler's formula. Formula is y n plus one r plus one r plus one r for iteration is equal to is equal to y n plus h divided by two h divided by two into f of x n comma y n x n comma y n plus f of x n plus one comma y n plus one Close this square bracket. Where yn plus 1 r, yn plus 1 r is yn plus h into f of xn comma y. So let me call this as equation 1 and let me call this as equation 2. Okay. Now I want to find y1. How do I get y1? Put n is equal to 0 in 1. Put n is equal to 0 in 1, you get y1. Right? So let us put n is equal to 0. So I don't require this problem now. Uh, then as this. Then uh, I will write what is required here. I need this fx y is equal to x square plus y. x naught is 0. y naught is 1 x1 is 0 0.05 y1 we have to find out then x2 uh, is 0 0.1 y2 we need to find out okay. Okay. Not really. h is point 0 0.05 h is 0 0.05 0 0.05 0 okay. now for Put n is equal to 0 in 1. Put n is equal to 0 in the relation 1. And 2 also. Put n is equal to 0 in 1 and 2. So you get y1 r plus 1. y1 r plus 1 is equal to y0 plus h divided by 2. h divided by 2 into f of x naught comma y naught plus f of x1 comma y1 r y1 r call this as equation number 3 then y1 r is y naught plus h into f of x naught comma Call this as 4. Now for the iteration, let me fix r is equal to 0 in 3. So put r is equal to 0. Put r is equal to 0 in the equation 3. Put r is equal to 0 in the equation 3. So what do we get? When r is equal to 0, uh, we get y1. 1, y1 one, 1 is equal to y0 plus h by 2 into f of x0 comma y0 plus f of x1 comma y1 uh, 0, y1 0, all this as equation number 4. So I am fixing, I am fixing <coughs> r is equal to 0 in 3. So I get y1. Uh, okay, y1 is 0. Okay. What is y1 0? From 4. From 4. From 4. From the relation, from the equation 4. y1 0 is equal to, uh, y put r is equal to, y1 0 is equal to y0 plus h into 
يرفعها اكس نات كما هو اوكي اي نو ذا اكس اكس سكوير بلس واي سو اي كان رايت ذس اس واي نات وات از واي نات واي نات از واي بلس وات از اتش اتش از 0.05 اتش از 0.05 انتو يرفع اكس نات از 0 and y not is y f of x comma y is x square plus y therefore f of 0 comma 1 is 0 square plus 1 so this will give you 1 plus 1 plus 0 point 0 5 0 point 0 5 into uh, f of x comma y is x square plus y so this is 0 square that is 0 plus so this is uh, 1.05. So 1.05. Now let us use this value y10, which is equal to 1.05. Yeah, five. And obtain the first identity for y at x is equal to x1. So let me do it here. Let me do it here. <coughs> so from five, from Five from five y one one from five y one one is equal to eh, y naught. What is y naught? Y naught is one plus h zero point zero five divided by two into f of x naught comma y naught. That is 0 comma 1. F of 0 comma 1 plus F of x1. What is x1? 0 0.05. 0 0.05. 0 0.05. Comma. Uh, <coughs> y10. 1.05. 1. 0. 1. 0. Plus f of x1 0 0.05 comma y1 0 1.0 1.05 Now <coughs> apply the definition of f of x comma y. Apply the definition of f of x comma y. So y1 y is equal to 1 plus 0 0.05 divided by 2 into this is 0 square plus 1 or 0 plus 1 eh? because f of x comma y is x square plus y so 0 comma 1 is 0 square plus 1 then plus f of 0 0.05 comma 1.05 is 0 0.05 0 0.05 whole square plus 1.05 so this is 0 0.05 square plus 1.05 plus 1.05 plus 1.05 That's one point zero five. One point zero five. Okay. This is a point. Okay. Now if you compute this, if you compute this carefully, <coughs> what do you get? One point one point zero five one. One point zero five. Now this is the first iterative value of y at x is equal to x first, that is y11, 1, 1, 1. 1.05, 1. So next, <coughs> let us put r is equal to 1 in 3. Okay? Let me do it here. Uh, <coughs> put, okay. okay. So put r is equal to 1 okay? in 3. Put 
tar is equal to zero in three. So I get uh, one, one, one in three. So I get y one two, y one two is equal to everything same. So I get y one zero in place of y one zero, y one one. Just here put tar is equal to one, y one two, everything same, x one, y one. Okay, you call this as equation number six. Equation number six. <coughs> Otherwise, not to put. Otherwise, remove this. Okay. R is equal to one in three. We get this one, and you know what is y one one? Right? <coughs> so I can straight away compute that. I can straight away compute. So y one two is y not. Y not is one. H is zero point. 0.5 divided by 2 into f of 0 comma 1. X not is 0, y not is 1. Plus f of x one 0.05. Y one one is 1.0512. Close this square bracket. Okay, so let me compute this. So if you compute carefully. Uh, okay, we are talking the definition first. So y one two is equal to one plus zero point zero five divided by two into f of zero comma one is zero square that is x square plus one right? that is zero square plus one plus zero point zero five square plus one point zero five one three. Close. So if you carefully <coughs> calculate using calculator, we get one point zero five one three. One point zero five one three. So you can easily observe. <coughs> eh? First iteration, the second iteration are both equal to. Uh, Are both equal up to the four decimal places. That is 1.0513. Here also 1.0513. So when the two successive iterates are the same, up to the desired accuracy, four decimals or three decimals, whatever is specified in the problem. So we conclude that the value of y at x is equal to x1, that is y1, is 1.0513. So says says y11. And y one two, y one two, are the same up to four decimal places. Are are the same up to four decimal four decimal places up to four decimal. Uh, decimal places, decimal places. Y one, that is y, at x is equal to zero point zero five. Zero point zero five is equal to one point zero five one three. One point zero five one three. So I got the value one point zero five. One. Okay. Now we repeat the same thing. Now to find y two, what we have to do? We have to fix n is equal to one in equation number one and two. So let me repeat this. Put n is equal to one. So the equation is not here. Okay. Yeah. <coughs> okay. In one and two. So what do you get when you replace? I will replace n by one. You get one plus one y two. You get y two. One plus one y two is equal to y n. And n is equal to what? It is one. H by two. X n comma y n. N is one. X one comma y one. Plus x n plus one. N plus one plus one. X two comma y two r. Let me call this as equation number six. Let me call this as equation number six. Okay. Then again, 
Euler's formula will become y2 r uh, y1 y1 plus h into f of x1 comma y1. Let me call this as the equation six. Okay, so now let me fix r is equal to one in six. Put r is equal to one zero zero. Put r is equal to zero. First iteration, I get when r is equal to zero. Put r is equal to zero in six. So what do you get? Y two one. You get y two y two one is equal to uh, fix r is equal to zero in six y one uh, plus h by two h by two h by two f of x one comma y one f of x two comma y two when r is zero this will be zero <coughs> zero plus one so yeah zero okay. <coughs> so what is y two zero
zero five one three. Yeah, five. Zero point zero five comma one point zero five one three plus yeah five x two comma y two zero. So yeah five x two x two is zero point one zero point one comma y two zero is one point one zero three nine. Y two zero is one point one zero three nine. No. Now apply the limit uh, uh, definition. So y two one is one point zero five one three plus zero point zero five divided by two into uh, f of x comma y is x squared plus y. So point zero five zero point zero five whole square plus one point zero. Five one three plus plus point one square point one square plus one point one zero three nine plus one point one zero three nine. So if you carefully <coughs> calculate this. Carefully, you get 
y to 2 uh, so it's here y to 2 is equal to 1.105 1.105 Okay, so now we compare with the previous one Y11 is 1.1054 and Y22 is 1.10 Y21 Okay, one, one, three. One, three. There is a difference, there is a difference so this need to be a uh, correct uh, again by putting r is equal to 2 in 6. So I repeat this procedure, put r is equal to 2 in 6. So what do you get? 2 plus 1, y2, 3 will be in terms of y2, 2, y2, 2. And everything same y2 2 y1 is 1.0513 x2 is 0.1 and this is five five. so this is uh, ok 1.1054 This is 5, 3. Okay. Okay, fine. So now, after the definition, so you get 1.0513 plus 0 0.05 by 2, f of plus 1, 3, fine. <coughs> then x2.1 square plus 1.5, 1 1.1055. 1 if you carefully complete, uh, compute this one, if you compute carefully this one, you get y23, y23 also you see 1.1055. So say the second iterative value is 1.1055, third iterative value is also 1.1055. So since the two successive iterates, second and third coincide, so we conclude that the value of y at x is equal to x2 is 1.055. Since, since y1, y2, 2, y2, 2 and y2, 3 are the same are the same up to four decimal four decimal places y two is equal to y y two is equal to y at x is equal to point one point one Point one is equal to one point one zero five. So the value of y at x is equal to x two one point one zero five. So this completes the problem. So let me consider another problem. Let me consider another problem. Determine solve second problem. Solve the initial value problem. Solve the initial value problem
initial value problem. dy by dx, dy by dx is equal to 2 into y divided by x plus x cube. 2 into y divided by x plus x cube. With initial condition y is 0.5 when x is equal to 1. y is 0.5 when x is equal to 1. By using by using by using modify modify Euler's Euler's vector modify Euler's method <coughs> modify Euler's method for x is equal to 1.2 and x is equal to 1.4 x is equal to 1.2 and x is equal to 1.4. Carry out. Carry out. Carry out. Three iterations. Three iterations. Three iterations. At each stage. At each stage. At each stage. So we need to calculate three iterations at each stage, whether they coincide or not, uh, doesn't matter. You compute three iterations and take the third iteration as the value of y at the particular particular value of x. So as usual, we shall write down what is given in the problem. That is very important. Once you write what is given in the problem, automatically what is to be done is defined there itself. <coughs> so given, given f of x comma y is equal to 2 into y divided by x plus x t. Okay, so then the values of x x naught is 1. As I told you, the, quantity, the number written in this open bracket is x naught <coughs> and this is your y naught. So y naught is 0.5. y naught is 0 0.5. The next value of x, what you see, next higher value of x is 1.2 and then 1.4. So x bar is 1.2. x bar is 1.2. So corresponding value of y at x is equal to 1.2 need to be calculated using modified Euler's method. Then next value uh, is x2 is 1.4. 1.4. The corresponding value of y2 we need to calculate using Euler's modified method. So now I will remove this uh, question for what of space. I write down the data and then proceed. <coughs> okay. So fx y is given to me 2y divided by x plus x cube. Then x naught is given to me 1. Corresponding y naught is 0.5. 0.5 then x1 is 1.2 corresponding y1 we need to find x2 is 1.4 corresponding value y2 we need to find and h is we can easily make out x2 minus x1 or x1 minus x0 and equal to this value of x is 0.2 h is 0.2 so let me not disturb this. So I will keep it in this box. Let me keep this in this box. Now, 
Let me start the modified minus to find values at these points of x. Okay. So modify modify minus formula minus formula. Let me write down modified minus formula once again. In general, y n plus one is equal to y n plus h divided by two into f of x n comma y n plus f of x n plus one. So this is r plus one. R plus one. Okay. X n plus one comma y n plus one. Y n plus one R like this. Close the open bracket, then square bracket. Let me call this as equation number one. Then y n plus one r is y n plus h into f of x n comma y. Call me this as two. So basically, two is coming from either side. Two is the either side. Now, to find y1, I have to fix n is equal to 0 in 1 and 2. So put, put n is equal to 0 in 1 as well as n2. Put n is equal to 0 in 1 and 2. Okay. <coughs> Next, <coughs> what happens when n is 1, you get y1 r plus 1, y1 r plus 1 is equal to y0 plus h divided by 2 into f of x0 comma y0 plus f of x1 comma y1 r. So call this as equation number 3. Call this as 3. Equation three. <coughs> then equation two becomes y one r is equal to y naught plus h into f of x naught comma y naught. So call this as equation four. Now for iteration, I have to fix r is equal to zero in three. Put r is equal to zero in the equation three. Put r is equal to 0 in 3. So what happens here? When r is equal to 0, you get y1, 1 is equal to y0 plus h divided by 2 into f of x0 comma y0 plus f of x1 comma y1 to 0. Close the bracket. y1. Call this as equation 5. Call this as equation number one. Okay, so now <coughs> if I substitute for y one zero from four, I can compute y one one. If I substitute y one zero from four, I can compute first iterative value y one. Okay, y one one. So now from four, from the equation four. From the equation for y10, y10 is equal to y0. What is y0 here? Uh, y0 is 0.5. y0 is 0.5 plus uh, from 4, h is uh, 0 0.2, h is 0 0.2. F of x0 comma y0, that is 1 comma 0.5. Remember, yeah, the definition is different now. Yeah, f of x comma y is 2y by x plus x cube. 2y by x plus x cube. So let us substitute here. So this is equal to 0.5 plus 0.2, 0.2 into 2y. That 
that is 2 into 0.5 divided by x, x is 1 plus x cube 1 plus 1 cube. Is that right? Let's say this. Right? Okay. So when you compute this, 2 into 0.5 by 1 plus 1 cube, you get, you get, carefully if you use calculator and compute, you get 0 0.9. Y10, 0, 0 0.9. Okay. 0.9. Okay. Now let me put substitute in 5 and then apply Y1. So I will use this base here. <coughs> From from uh, equation 5, from equation 5, <coughs> y1, 1 is equal to y0, y0 is 0.5, y0 is 0.5 plus h by 2, h is 0 0.2, 0 0.2 divided by 2, 0 0.2 divided by 2 uh, into f of <coughs> from 5 here x naught comma y naught 1 comma 0 0.1 1 comma 0.5 1 comma 0.5 plus plus f of x1 x1 is 1.2 x1 is 1.2 y10 y10 is 0 0.2 y10 0. 0. So if you compute this, if you compute this, what do you get? So y1 y is equal to 0.5 plus h is 0.2 divided by 2. 1 comma f of 1 comma 0.5. Applying this definition, 2 into 0.5 divided by 1. So this is 2 into 0.5 divided by 1 plus x cube plus x cube that is 1 cube plus second term. Similarly, <coughs> this is 2 into y. y is 0.9. 2 into 0.9 divided by x 1.2 plus x cube. 1.2 whole cube. 1.2 whole cube. So this is equal to, if you carefully compute, right, what you get? Y11, 1.0, 1.0, 1.0, 1 double 2, 8. This is the first iteration. So I will carry out three iterations at each stage, three iterations at each stage and then stop. Okay. So then, okay. so now to find y12, second iteration, what I have to do, second iteration, I have to fix R is equal to 1 in 3. Okay. So, okay. I will uh, just uh, adjust here only. Put R is equal to 1 in 3. Put R is equal to 1 in 3. So, what do you get? R is equal to 1 means Y12. Y12. So, Y12 is everything same. So, when R is 1, you get Y1, 1 here. Y1 pi. So let me substitute here. Let me substitute. Let me substitute. <coughs> so Y12 is Y0. Y0 is 0 0.5. 0 0.5. Plus H by 2. 0 0.2 divided by 2. Into F of X0. 1 comma. Uh, 0 0.5. 0 0.5. 1 comma 0.5 plus f of x1 
1.2 y11 y11 is 1.0 double 2 yeah. plus I think and clear here yeah? 0.5 everything same no change only thing in place of y1 0 you have x1 uh, y1 1 now let me apply the definition. So y12, y12 will be 0 0.5, 0 0.2 by the things here, f of 1 comma 0 0.5, f of 1 comma 0 0.5, correct? Yeah, x not comma y not. Then uh, okay, everything said. Uh, <coughs> okay. So y12, y12 will be y12, 0 0.5, 0 0.2 by 2, uh, 2 into y, 0.5 divided by 1, plus 1 cube, plus 2.2 into, 2 into y, y is 1.0 double 2, 2, 2 into 1.0 double 2, 8, double 2, 8, divided by 1.2 plus 1.2 whole cube plus 1.2 whole cube close the okay okay so when you carefully calculate using calculator you get 1.0432 1. 1.0432 this is the second iteration. So let me compute the third iteration. So I have to replace only R by 2 in 3 to get Y13. Y13. Y13 will be everything same. You get when R is 2, X1, Y1. Y1. Okay. Y1. <coughs> okay, everything same here. So y12 is 1.0432, 0432, okay. Now after the definition now, everything said, so 1.2, till here same, 2 into 1.0432, 0432, 0432, uh, divided by 1.2 x plus x cube 1.2 whole cube so if you carefully <coughs> calculate so y13 this is 3 now y13 y13 will be y13 will be 1.04 double 6 1.04 double 6 so we have to stop here because the question is carry out only Three iterations at each stage. At this stage, three iterations over. So we conclude that so therefore y1 is equal to value of y at x is equal to 1.2. At x is equal to 1.2 is 1.0466. So we can take this value of y at x is equal to 1.2. 1.04 Six, up to four decimal places. So next I have to compute y at x is equal to x2 that is at x is equal to 1.4. So I have to fix, I have to find y2. So how do I get y2? Replacing n by 1 in 1 and 2. So <coughs> okay. Put n is equal to 1. Okay, it is here. Put n is equal to 1 in 1 and 2 then you get <coughs> y2 you get y2 r plus 1 see here 1 plus 1 y2 r plus 1 y1 so yn become y1 then h by 2 h by 2 uh, x1 comma y1 plus f of n 1 plus 1 y2 comma y2 r call this as 6 call this as equation number 6 <coughs> okay 
call this as equation number 6 then uh, 2 also becomes y2 or uh, uh, it will be in terms of y1 again y1 y1 h equal to f of x1 comma y1 x1 comma y1 call this as equation number 7 equation number 7 I am fixing n is equal to 1 now to get y2. So y2 r plus 1, y1, n is 1, h by 2, x1, y1, plus 1 plus 1, x2, y2 r, where y2 r in terms of y1 plus h t of r, x1 comma y1. Fine. Okay, so now. Y21 
y2 y is equal to y1 1.04 double 6 04 double 6 plus h by 2 0.2 by 2 0.2 divided by 2 into f of x1 comma y1 that is f of x1 1.2 comma 1.04 double 6 1.04 6 6 close the bracket plus f of plus f of uh, x2 x2 is 1.4 1.4 comma y20 y20 is 1.7410 y2 is 1.7410 okay now let me ask you the definition definition of f of x comma y so this is equal to 1.04 double 6 plus 0.2 divided by 2 2 into y by x. 2 into 2 into 1.0466. Okay. Let me start from here. Is equal to 1.0466. Plus 0.2 divided by 2 point 2 divided by 2 f of 1 point 2 comma 1 point 0 4 is 2 into 1 point 0 4 6 6 divided by 1 point 2 plus plus 1 point 2 whole cube whole cube plus for this one, 2 into 1.7410 divided by divided by x that is 1.4 plus 1.4 whole cube 1.4 whole cube close the bracket close the bracket so if you carefully compute y21 will be if you carefully compute y21 <coughs> okay, if you carefully compute you get 1.9169 1.9169 that is the value first alternative value y21 is equal to 1.9169 okay so now to get the second iterating i have to fix r is equal to 1 in 6 okay i'll write, I'll write here only put r is equal to 1 in 6 to get y2 in 6 means here uh, 1 plus 1 is 2 y2 y2 2 is equal to uh, we are changing only R, so everything will remain the same. X1, Y1, X2, Y2, 1. Y2, 1. Okay. Now let us take this value here and then compute Y2. So this is equal to Y1, 1.0466, 0466 plus 0 0.2 divided by 2 into x1 y1 f of uh, 1.2 comma 1.0466 1.0466 plus plus f of uh, x2 x2 is 1.4 x2 is 1.4 y2 1 y21 is 1.9169 plus the bracket f of 1.4 comma 1.9169 okay. now 
let me apply the definition y22 y22 1.0466 plus 0 0.2 divided by 2 0.2 divided by 2 into 2 into 1.0466 by 1 by, uh, 1.2 plus 1.2 whole cube. Now you get another term, another term plus <coughs> plus 2 into 1.9169 divided by x that is 1.4 plus x cube 1.4 whole cube plus 1.4 whole cube. Now close the bracket. Close the bracket. So if you carefully calculate using calculator, we get y22 y22 is equal to 1.9420 1.9420 this is the second iterative value. So next, the third iterative value at fix r is equal to 2 in 6. r is equal to 2 in 6 means you get y23, y23, uh, etc. etc. You get r is 2, no? so you get y2. Okay. y22 is 1.9420. So everything same. So you get 1.9420. Nine four two zero. I will change here only, but we have to practice. One point nine four two zero. Then apply the definition. I get. I get everything same. One point zero four six six plus point two by two. I have four. One point two comma one point zero four six six is two into y two into one point zero four six six divided by one point two plus x cube that is 1.2 whole cube plus 2 into uh, y is 9420 9420 divided by 1.4 plus 1.4 whole cube so if you carefully calculate you get y23 1.94 1.9456 1 so this is at the third stage so we conclude that the value of y. <coughs> we conclude the value of y. So therefore, uh, y2, that is value of y at x is equal to 1.4 is equal to y2. This is y2. 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 One is equal to y at x is equal to 1.4 is 1.9456. So this is 1.9456. So this completes the third problem. Second problem. So this completes the second problem and continue uh, the remaining problems, another at least one or two problems in my next class. Thank you.